Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I know my background has been different. Um, I think last video and this video. Um, I'm just trying to figure some shit out. Excuse my language. I'm just trying to figure some shit out, you know. So this might not be the background for a lot of videos. I know it's kind of plain. It's my living room. Sorry for that. But yes, um, this is the look that I came up with today i am really really feeling it like if you didn't know blue is one of my favorite colors and i know this is not like blue blue but it's like teal close you know but anywho i'm just really feeling this look and i'm really trying to jump back into things like i told you guys like since i've been like mia and all that type of stuff so I really hope you guys enjoy this look. And if you want to see how I got it, please keep watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace. So first I'm going to start out with my ColourPop Brow Pencil in black and brown and fill in my eyebrows. Then next, I'm going to come in with my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Espresso and clean up my brows. Now I'm taking my Urban Decay Primer Potion, eyeshadow primer potion in original and placing this on my lids. Then I'm going to set that with my Airspun Translucent Powder. So now I'm taking my MAC studio fix foundation in nw50 and i'm placing this color right in my crease so now i'm going to take my cultural sense october fest and i'm going to bring this in the crease as well but slightly under where i put the first transition color now i'm coming in with this ulta gilded gold palette and i am going to take this color called scorched For a darker brown, I'm coming in with my Morphe 35O palette, and I'm going to take this color right here. And since I have hooded eyes, I'm bringing it slightly above my crease area. I'm basically going to be mixing colors until I get the look that I want. So I'm coming back in with this palette and I'm going to take this brown shade and mix it with this one. So these two right here. Now I'm coming in with a blending brush and just blending those edges out. I'm going to come in with this hot pot from Coastal Scents and it's called Cherry Chocolate. It has a little bit of shimmer. It's like a brown with some maroon type of reflex in it. And I'm just going to pack that on top of the other browns. Yep, that's the one I want. Now I'm just going to take a blending brush and blend the edges out again. Now on the back of my hand, I have my Too Faced Glitter Glue and I'm going to place that down on my lid and on top of that, 
coming in with my Manly 120 palette. This is the bottom layer, and I'm going to come in with this color right there and place that on top. Now onto the face. I'm going to prime my face with my Smashbox Photo Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. To color correct, I'm coming in with my Anastasia Cream Contour Kit in deep, and I'm gonna come in with this middle peachy shade and just hit, you know, my dark spot which I just have on my cheek, nose, and chin. Okay. And for foundation today, I'm coming in with a little concoction. I'm gonna take my Revlon Color Stay in Cappuccino. It's like empty. And I'm gonna take my MAC Studio Sculpt. And this is in the shade NC50. And I'm also gonna mix that with my NYX liquid illuminator and this is in the shade gleam mix that on the back of my hand and pat it onto the skin with my beauty blender okay i'm taking the same contour kit from anastasi and i'm going to come in with this color and it's called cinnamon To set all of that, I'm using my Cody Airspun. I'm sweeping the excess away with a brush. I'm not applying a cream contour today. I'm just gonna do powder. So I'm coming in with my Black Radiance Contour Kit in medium to dark with the contour shade and just chisel out my cheek. In my waterline, I'm going to take the Coastal Scents uh, Cherry Chocolate on a little pencil brush, and I'm just going to place that down there. I meant my lower lash line, not my waterline. I'm trying to avoid the waterline. Now, in my waterline, I'm going to take this white eyeliner. Now, on top of that, I'm going to take the second layer of the Manly 120 palette, and I am going to come in with this shade, all of those, well, not all of the eyeshadows, but a few eyeshadows just dropped out. Oh, and another one. But anywho, I am going to take that shade and pop that into the waterline. Now I'm going to come in with my Tartiste Clay Paint Eyeliner and I'm going to make a wing. I'm going to highlight taking my Anastasia Glow Kit and as you know I'm taking all four highlighters and packing that onto my cheeks. Oh. Now I'm going to take some mascara. I'm taking my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and I'm going to coat my bottom lashes. Now for lashes today, I'm going to take these Kiss Lashes in the style Daisy. I'm going to pop these on and be right back to finish the rest of the look. Now for lips today, I'm taking my NYX 
liquid suede lipstick in sandstorm on top of that I'm going to come in with a brown lip liner I know I love a matte lip, but I'm going to come in with my Nana Coco Gloss in Let It Shine and pop this right on top. This is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, it was a fun look to create and I'm really, really feeling this might have to wear it out one day <laughs> but let me know what you guys think and i'll see you in my next video bye